Hey everyone, I just wanted to give you a quick update with what's going on with Wise Network. Um, I want to thank you all for all the memberships that um, we've already gotten in and look forward to anybody else who'd like to join. So feel free to invite your lady um, business owners and friends that would like to join Wise Network and get their business promoted um, for the entire year for around $50. Um, feel free to invite them and let them be a part. So, but I wanna talk, the main point of this video is to talk about what is coming up for the November WISE networking uh, luncheon. And we are actually meeting in person. We're gonna have a luncheon. And trust me, um, we're all a little bit scared about meeting in person. I totally understand that. Um, the last, you know, I don't know, six months or so I've been working in a COVID ICU unit um, in a local hospital here in town. And, um, you know, where I work, it's mostly elderly um, that are very much sick and dying from COVID. So I do take it very seriously. However, um, you know, the mandates have been lifted and we're gonna try to make it as safe as possible. So in that, um, in that theme and that responsibility, what we're doing is we're meeting at a local restaurant. That restaurant is called Sweet Mama's Country Kitchen. It's located behind um, the Clinton Body Shop on Neal Street, and it has a private dining room area. Um, now that private dining room area normally fits about 45 people. We are gonna fill it no more than half of the capacity. So we have a limited number of seats available. So um, I will be following up with you closer to time to make sure you really are going and to make sure our numbers are true. Um, and also we will be trying to space ourselves apart since it's gonna be at 50% capacity. Now they have another um, luncheon area as well. And that luncheon area will be for other people who come into their restaurant to eat. We are just gonna be in the private dining room area. And there's actually a separate door so we can go into that area and sit down at our seats. There'll be a sheet of paper on, the, on your place setting and it will give you an option of what you would like, you circle what you want to eat. Um, so the main course meals will be um, smothered pork chops, uh, fried pork chops, fried chicken, and baked chicken. Um, the other, I am putting a picture of what their normal Tuesday meal is in this event and are in the events on Facebook and you can kind of see. Now, of course, if there's something that's strange with the availability, it, something may change or not be allowed, um, but that's what their normal Tuesday luncheon um, would be. So you just circle what you want and you put your name on it and they will prepare it for you and then all the tickets will go, be collected at one time. They will prepare it for you and bring it back to the table. Um, and it's in to-go to boxes anyways, but you can put on there to-go so that they know that you won't be eating or whatever. And um, then you can take it with you. If you don't want to eat there, you're more than welcome to eat there. Um, but, you know, once again, to be as safe as possible, if you feel like you want to wear a mask the whole time and eat your lunch later, you're more than welcome. Um, you can take off a mask if you're eating, um, but if you're just talking and socializing at that point, we'd want you to wear your mask. Um, so that's what the, the luncheon thing will be. So it'll be very little movement around and um, they will collect all the sheets at one time and bring all our food at one time. So um, it makes it a lot safer that way. Um, one of the reasons why I want to meet in person is that this is usually one of our biggest events of the year. This is when you are the guest speaker and you get to talk about your business. So it doesn't matter if you're a member or not, you're welcome to come. And um, all you have to do is pay for your lunch. Everybody's lunch is, um, everyone has to pay for their lunch. Members have to pay for their lunch. Everyone has to pay for their lunch. So um, their lunch cost is $10.99 and we would hope that you would tip them as well. Um, and you get uh, an entree, three sides, bread, dessert, and a drink for $10.99. So you can't beat it. It's a wonderful cost. And um, I love that we're supporting a local business. That makes it even that much better. So um, what we'll do is you will also bring a small gift. It should be under $20. It can be 
um, very, I want it to be a small cost and it either represents you or your business. So, you know, it's important to me that we include other people who don't necessarily own a business and that just want to support locally owned, uh, women owned businesses or run or, um, you know, you may not actually own your business, but you may be a salesperson for it, a realtor or, um, I don't know, uh, anyways, we want the, per the female that's representing the business to be promoted. And so that's what we love about Wise Network, um, women who inspire, support, and encourage each other. So um, he'll bring a small gift, something that represents you. It doesn't, if you don't own a business, that's fine. We're just glad you're there supporting other women who do own businesses. And what this will do is give us an opportunity to showcase our products, talk about our products, and let other people get to know us. And even if you don't have a business, we'll get to know you and see how we can support you. And we'll be happy to do that and in any way we can. So that's what this meeting is about. It's normally a large turnout and it's really not something that's conducive to doing it online as easily as it is in person. And this way we can do a gift exchange all at the same time. So I'm really excited about that. We try to do it in November so that you have ideas for shopping for December. Um, and for the winter holidays. So that's what that's about. And I really hope that you can go. Um, and also to cut down in um, amount of times we get out and socialize. Um, I also want to talk, this would be a good time to bring your ornament. Now, I don't know if the library is going to be doing the trees like they've always done in the past. I absolutely love this event, so I really do hope they do. But I'm not sure if they will. So the other thing about this event with the, the ornament is normally um, what we do is we ask everyone to bring in three ornaments that have their business card on it and we decorate the Wise Network tree with the ornaments that everyone brings. Um, however, this time, this time it's very possible that the library will not do the, the Festival of the Trees. It's such a pretty um, event. I really, I really hope they do, but if they don't, I'm looking for a local business, a Wise Network business, somebody that we promote that would like to host a tree in their business that we could hang the ornaments on. So that may be you. Um, so if that's something you're interested in, reach out to me. And what, what you do is you simply take your business card, which now I've lost for some reason. Um, but anyways, my, one of the businesses that I own is a um, 52 Bible Lessons. It's a Bible curriculum for children. So this little Dollar Tree cross um, at, you know, local here in Clinton, picked it up at Northside. All I would have to do is take uh, one of these things and punch a hole in my business card and take a piece of ribbon and tie it onto this and it's done. That simple, okay? Uh, it's a great little decoration for the Christmas tree. Um, this one, because I'm, like I said, it's 52 Bible um, lessons, a church, that would work well for that one as well. But let's say you yours doesn't relate to church type thing, which is totally fine. Um, you could take just another pretty ornament like this one, also done at Dollar Tree, and um, you could just take your business card and punch a hole into it and tie it on there. Really, really simple. And Dollar Tree has lots of really pretty ornaments right now, okay? Because it's only October, so they have lots of things available. So, um, what I would recommend is that you go ahead and go to um, Dollar Tree and pick up three ornaments. I think that there's, I was trying to find, oh, here's like the business card. <laughs> that figures. Um, here's another one right here. They even have some that are two or three in a bag, you know, together. So for the cost of two to three dollars, you can just attach your business card to it and we will set up a tree somewhere, um, either at the library or at a local business here and we will decorate it all with the ornaments. And our goal is for people to take the ornaments that have business cards on them and for them to support that business as well. So don't expect to get your ornament back. Um, and if your three are gone at some point, you're more than welcome to refill them. Um, we just don't want the whole tree covered with one ornament um, for one business. But it's all about us all coming in together and helping to support each other. 
So if this is something that you're interested in and you'd like to participate, um, you could bring your ornaments to the luncheon already done and we can get those hung up for you wherever that's gonna be. So I hope this answers a lot of your questions. I, if you have any more questions, please feel free to message me. My name is Lorraine Gilbert. I'm the president of Wise Network. I'm also an independent uh, consultant for Rodan and Fields. I'm also the author of 52 Bible Lessons. And um, I would be happy to help you in any way I can. Thank you. Bye.